10 years. Can you guys believe it's been 10 years since I started releasing abridged videos? Considering how long it's been since my last episode was released, yes, I certainly can believe it's been that long. <laughs> Sorry, by the way. But that aside for now, thank you so much for being here and enjoying the nonsense I make. When I started this all 10 years ago, I wasn't really doing it to get, you know, popular. I was mainly making this just for myself. Just something I thought would be fun to do, something different, and be able to share it with whoever would take the time to watch it. And hey, if no one did, no real loss on my part, I would still enjoy it. But I'm sure you can tell that's not the case just by looking at how many subscribers I've had over the years. Now, not all of them are still here watching me, but just the fact that I got that many people's attention is amazing to me. Now, I struggled with coming up with what to do for my anniversary video this year. I am running low on ideas and that do not take forever in a day to make. I had trouble with that until I remembered something that I absolutely love and appreciate to this day. It was given to me at the start of all of this. When I had started going onto YouTube and watching videos, the thing that I enjoyed almost as much as the videos themselves was the comment sections. I loved seeing what people liked about the videos, what they didn't like about them, the ideas they got from the videos that they would share with everyone. I thought it was a lot of fun, and I thought, you know, along with making a video of my own, I thought it would be awesome to see what other people would say about my stuff. So I made a channel. This channel, to be specific. <laughs> when I made my first episode to my first Wind Waker abridged, I did not expect the first comment to be what it was. This is what it said. LOL, you're really good. You could rival Adam West Lapdog, Neva1212, Time Dragon X, and Tykathia. I really hope you continue, and you're right. Why can't they ever spread gumdrops? It always has to be darkness or something. Now, you may not recognize some of those names, but I did. At that time, they were the top Zelda bridges on YouTube. Like, they were considered the best. And I was flattered. With my first video, I impressed someone enough for them to leave that as their first comment. And it was the first one I ever got. That was amazing to me. Now, I don't believe myself that I was as good as they were. I, you know, I accepted the flattery, but I was really thinking to myself, yeah, I don't believe I'm as good as them, but I still greatly appreciate what you said. I didn't think I was that good at these videos, especially when you consider the fact I had just started to learn how to make, how to make them, how to do, use my editor and everything. But it made me really happy and encouraged me to keep making videos and improve them as much as possible. And now, I have thousands of people who watch my silly videos and they leave their own comments. And I'll tell you right now, I read every single one. Every single one of the comments I on my channel, I have read. Like, I do not skip any of them. <laughs> it helps that I don't have, you know, such a huge popularity that there's no way I could read every single one, but I do read every single comment. Uh, I don't respond to all of them, mostly because I'm not good at leaving comments myself. I can never think of what to say, but I just want you to know that I do read and appreciate all of them. Even the annoying ones. And there are plenty. <laughs> I, I really do love you guys. None of you are really offensive trolls. You all seem to just want to have fun being here and, and just experience this, my videos and everything with each other. And that's what I wanted to do with my videos, to have fun, to make people smile. And judging from how many, how, how many of the you don't know how much I needed this today comments I get, I'm doing exactly that, making people happy, even if it's just a little bit. That has always been my main goal, and I'm so happy I get to share that with all of you. Now, this is probably going to be my last anniversary video I make for a long time. Mainly because I feel I never have time to give you a properly worked on video with how busy I've gotten in life. But I just want all of you to know how much I love having you all here. And that was the main inspiration for my anniversary videos to begin with. To be like, hey, not only have I gone this far in what I can do, but I want you guys to know that I'm paying attention to you guys. To let you know that I do love having you guys here. So with all that being said, 
Thank you everyone so much for watching my videos over the years, and I hope I can continue putting smiles on your faces for another 10 years, if not longer. Uh, we'll see what the next decade has to bring. Anyways, uh, this has been Tower Paw. Uh, sorry it's not a very long video. I did Again, I didn't have a lot of time to work on it. I've been working the last several days and not having a lot of time to work on stuff. But thank you so much for watching this. And I will see you all next video. Love you guys. Bye-bye. <laughs>